Hi, this is Needlepointers.com. Today I'd like to show you how to make these la mask lanyards and these are really helpful like when you have these ear loop type masks and like you're taking them on and off say you're shopping or you, you know you're going in and out of stores or you're going in and out of your car and you don't feel like wearing your mask the whole time that you're driving around or whatever this can help you by because it has, it's just a cord that hangs around your neck and then hooks onto your mask, the, the sides of your mask and you can just put your mask on and then take, take your mask off and it would hang around your neck like a necklace. And these are really simple to make. No sewing is required. They are using cam snaps, which I love cam snaps. For these kinds of projects. What I'm using for the lanyard is ribbon that you can get for any personality. You can. This one is Star Wars. I have one here that is sewing and I got a bunch of other ones. I got Minions and some this is unicorns for kids and Batman Harry Potter and there, there's all kinds of ribbon that you can find in different um, themes so you can probably find one for almost any theme so the other thing you need for this project is cam snaps they come in all different colors you can get a starter pack for not that much money and the, if you don't already have one make sure you get a cam snap pliers because this makes it super simple to install the cam snaps and they come it comes with this all click the link in the description of this video or in the iCard to go to our website needlepointers.com for a step-by-step -step photo tutorial on how to do this project and also to find where I purchased these fun different gr uh, ribbons and these ribbons are all gross grain ribbon ribbon which means they just have a little bit of a, a line across across them and these are this gross grain ribbon is the perfect kind of ribbon to use for this type of project so to make this project you need about 28 inches of ribbon total and for kids you might want to use it a little bit shorter so it doesn't hang down as far uh, the length can be adjusted according to your preference I'm going to make one with this minion ribbon. The first thing you do is measure 28 inches long and cut. Pick out the color cam snaps you want. Okay, so to start this, we take the ribbon facing the front side down, fold it up a half an inch, approximately, and then fold it up a whole inch. So um, I have a half inch underneath and that's so that the edge of the ribbon is tucked underneath and it won't fray. And then I have it folded over one inch. We'll poke a hole with the awl and we want the hole approximately centered top to bottom on your ribbon and about a quarter inch to a half inch back from the edge. So I make a hole with the awl. Take your pointed piece of your cam snap and insert it through from the front side of the ribbon. Stick it through and take one of the ends and usually I've been taking the male side and sticking it over top first. With your cam snap pliers you slide it in to the snap hole to the little there's like a little bowl and you slide your the flat part in and then cover it up and then make sure that you press down firmly and straight. So 
So there you've installed one cam, cam snap. If you're having trouble or you need more instructions on installing the cam snaps, we have a full tutorial on how to install cam snaps. And so go to the link in the description or in the iCard and there'll be a link to that tutorial also. Next we need to put the other side of the snap down the ribbon here. And I found the best spot to put it is if you line up the end of the ribbon and measure out one and a half inches approximately and we want to put the snap right there. Again take the, the pointed side of the snap and on this side you can usually just poke it right through the ribbon because it's only one layer. Now remember you have to match the other piece of the cam snap. So if you use the male side first on this one, make sure you use the female side on the other side. Um, don't put the same one on both or your snap will not work. And I'm going to slide it into my cam snap hole pliers and press down firmly. So that's one side completed. And I always test my cam snaps two or three times when I put them on to make sure that they don't come apart. Once in a while you find one that will come apart. And so that's half of it done already. Let's do the other half. To install the cam snap, or to install your new lanyard onto your mask, just put the elastic of your mask in between and snap it. And then make sure it doesn't twist when you put it on the other side. And then this can hang around your neck and you have a finished mask lanyard made with some fun ribbons that can match your child or your personality. I hope you enjoyed this quick project and of making mask lanyards and make some for yourself and your family so that you won't lose your masks. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel and click the like button if you like this video. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Pinterest. Visit our website, needlepointers.com, and while you're there, don't forget to subscribe to our newsletter so you're kept up to date on all our new videos and other things on our website. <music>